Hi! Surprise! I am live! Um, yeah, I, I, I didn't plan on, plan on being here, but I got home one day early, so, and I have... I really want to stream. <laughs> so, today I'm looking for the nuisance. That, because I know I moved Gavin and Brittany out with their son Bruno, but I can't remember where I put them. So um, I and I didn't notice in the spreadsheet. So we'll have to go and look for them. <laughs> so um yeah, that's a thing that happened. I have lost my Sims. <laughs> They're in here somewhere. I think they might be an apartment. They are now called the new sons because Gavin is the oldest son. The oldest son in the Newson family so I let him keep the name and Ginger took half John's name so they are the new burb so over here we have the Ottomas family they are unplayed but they have two new babies <coughs> oh dear <coughs> I'm so sorry uh, so they are not what we're looking for. No one is living in the trailer park. They're not in the retirement home. Here's the new burbs. Here's the freckles. No one is living over here currently. All the dreamer that is Mary Sue and he, she married Don Lothario and they have adopted Davis Jr. and little Sinavi here. Not sure how to pronounce that actually, even though that was me that put that name. <laughs> All right, here's the goth mansions. That is obviously not where they are. The orphanage is next up on uh, on the list to play for one day. Uh, we have only one day left of autumn, so we're going into into winter after that. Let's see. These are not the ones. Newson. Here we have them. In this new apartment complex over here. We can actually go into tab mode over here. And we can... Oh my goodness. We can get pretty close. <laughs> the Sims 4 could never. <laughs> uh, and I think I've been saving my image is in the wrong spot so i'll fix that real quick yeah i've been playing the the hobby hobbies uh where are we i think it's in n this looks right storytelling yes this is where we are I will have to do that the first time, then it will remember where I have saved them. So we are going into the Newsons family to see what, what's up with them. They moved out of the Newsons house because there was just too many children. Because both Ginger and John wants to copulate all the time. <laughs> oh dear, we're in a tree. Oh, look at this. They... Obviously, I think, I think like they just moved in. So they're over here and it's not the best apartment that you can find or the best looking one. I'm looking at the ground now, but it's okay. It looks kind of weird with that support system down here. It's kind of empty, but that's the way it is and I don't know why but it seems like if you're hired in the mili military you're like required to patrol this this street I don't know, understand but that that happens oh and Brittany wants another baby <laughs> all right well did I hire oh Gavin is about to hire uh, an apartment over here so he's signing the contract and we are is he going to go inside and show me which one is theirs 
We need. We might need to decorate here. It's obviously upstairs. Okay. Oh, I have already doc um, decorated. It seems he's putting away fish that he has caught. It's a very cramped apartment, but they don't seem to have much money left, do they? I'll keep the spreadsheet over here. Um. Oh, uh, right. Well, I'm not sure. It seems they have a loan. Do they? Where's the loan jar? There it is. They have 2,400 in the loan. And it says rent is only 5%. That is not correct because they are living in, in, in an apartment. So they will have to have interest rate of 9% percent because they ha don't have a house there we go but it seems they have some money in the bank is there a bank online there it is it's it's faster to click withdraw than check money bank accounts my account <laughs> it's the same result 3200 it seems my spreadsheet is up to date regarding this, but I'm just going to check um, 4,500 for her. So they have a little bit of money. Um, and I think, okay, so Brittany has more money. So she's going to withdraw uh, like a thousand in case they have expenses. Suddenly, we don't want those stiff any nanny or something. What is this? some kind of book uh, maybe you can put that away Gavin it looks weird <laughs> there you go <clears throat> did I say three thousand I didn't mean to do that I I said a thousand and I meant the thousand so I'm gonna deposit where is it deposit 2000 i don't know how that happened what is going on here oh wait i already had that queued up for her for some reason did did they need to buy stuff or something i don't know but i have locked in the wish to have a baby oh wait no i don't know <laughs> well they want to have a baby they have one toddler they do not have room for any additional children otherwise the spreadsheet says to adopt What are they doing over here, though? <laughs> this is silly. Why do they have this very silly, very small apartment? Maybe we, the first thing we got to do for them is actually move them again. Um, I feel like maybe we do that. Maybe we withdraw all the monies and move them to a bigger apartment because they want more children and also, the orphanage is desperate. They they require everyone that can to adopt, or like requ require like they 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 want that to happen, you know. So now she has zero dollars in the bank account. Cause I'm not I'm not sure this is a good idea, but it's what I'm gonna do. She's gonna move out of the way. And he can try and sit on this chair and then he can um, withdraw everything. They are married now, so they um, they share finances now. <laughs> they didn't have uh, a big difference in their bank account, so I'm not too worried about that. So we are going to take all of their stuff and... If you press I, 
it plops down in the inventory. So let's let's just do that. We can't take this one, unfortunately. But here's a strange thing. We can take the entire kitchen and we probably shouldn't because it's not really theirs. But that's what they did. I'm gonna take everything that isn't nailed to the floor, <laughs> which is pretty much everything. Uh, they can take that desk though, if he gets up. So Gavin got everything in his inventory. It's gonna be easier after the move. Still can't do that. <laughs> I think I think what we gotta do because you can't put the computer in the inventory, but we can delete it so we can sell that. Did I only get uh, fifty simoleon for that? It says I'm gonna get one thousand three hundred fifty. I did okay. And the loan jar and what what is going on now? Oh, I'm not, I'm not in live mode. That's why. There. So that's everything I think. If they forgot something here, then they forgot something. Because they only they almost have like ten thousand. So they should have they they should be able to afford an apartment over here <laughs> or a bigger one here i don't know I, it feels like they weren't in the right spot so i'm going to go into i'm gonna save and we're gonna go that, that was a short visit i think they just moved in but you know sometimes We are going to go into neighborhood. And then we're going to move family. <laughs> and you do that. Oh, they can't live here because it's full. Is this the best apartment I can find for them? Well, maybe, maybe we move them out because, let, let's see here, I'm going to move them out and then they have 11,000, so see they can't move in there. That's quite a lot of money. Why is this show so cheap compared to this one? <laughs> I built a little trailer over here, but they only have 11,000. They need, I think I said that you need like enough money to buy a complete house and then 5,000 extra, like that's just the rules. Is 11,000, no, if you're gonna buy an empty lot like this, you need 20,000, that's the rule that the city council has decided. <laughs> but we can go over to the shopping district and see, like, I, I hope there's bigger apartments there. And if they're not, we should put some down, I think. <sighs> uh, this is the crappy part. Town, like we do have... I think these are living in pretty small apartments.
Uh, that one is full. Th that's not where they want to live anyway. Maybe there's... Wait, isn't there a little cottage somewhere? I, I need to check. I think there's a little cottage in the outskirts of town. You should be able to buy that. I never moved anyone in there. So maybe this is when I do that. Uh, where is it though? I know I've seen it. There's a, like a little cottage over here. But they can't afford it because it's too expensive. Okay. All right. I thought maybe we could move in here and it should be fine, but no. <clears throat> so I'm sorry about the going back and forth, but I don't feel like Pleasant View. Uh, should we like spend this stream building a skyscraper? <laughs> that could be fun. I don't think I will though, uh, but I, I do feel I think they were in the best apartment. So I feel like... Oh, we have these over here too. They're, they're be better spaced, I think. So let, let's try this. Uh, move into an empty apartment unit. Yes. Yes. I, th I think there's more space in there because like they had all, all their stuff was on top of each other so maybe the nuisance Gavin and Brittany can have a better apartment over here I think there's one oh my goodness <laughs> the taxi didn't know which way to drive did it okay so let's see now see these are bigger but they're they're cheaper i don't understand um that's taken that's sartor and this is barrett this is the thayer household dustin lives there with meadow but she went to prison and this is vacant so let's try this one uh rent apartment yes so that took 636 from his bank account or for from their household funds immediately so we can note that in the spreadsheet I don't, I'm not sure uh, if I need that I'm going to add a column for rent because it drives me nuts. <laughs> this is my money calculation and it's all... We have Gavin in here but I'm not sure. Ginger is new verb. It's all, it's all um, in a mess over here. Okay, well, she is like, no. Okay, this is the right word and this is the right color. Okay. And he should be above her. Anyway, now Gavin can have, we don't know his daily bills, but we can, Right, what was it then? It says so. 636 for daily rent. And well, I'll, I'll try and fix this. We need to. I, I added this column. I didn't have that before. I, I put it in with the daily bills and it was really confusing. <laughs> so we don't have anything in bank accounts. We don't have loans right now. Uh, but the, do we? Did we have a loan? Yeah, well, I, th I think we did have a loan. And then interest is 9%. Um, anyway, what I was going to fix is... Uh, 
they have what is happening here yeah only have one beneficiaries now and weekly expenses should be that wait I'm gonna move it into daily weekly bills it's going to be just plus the rent then there you go and everyone else don't have rent but I'm gonna do this or I'll never never remember to do it okay we don't need the money calculation really for these this family since it's a played family but I like to, to enter the number sometimes and um, figure out if they If they're on the plus side or if they're supposed to be moving or something okay so now we have a different screenshot of them like signing a new contract like straight after the first one <laughs> okay they're moving a lot but I think this is a bit nicer for them like it's on the bottom floor so they can like uh, go in and out as they please and this is undecorated but uh, the good thing here is we can have like a children's room over here <clears throat> and we don't need wait is this a nicer fridge I don't think that's a nicer stove and this these are the same but it has a sink. Well, I'm just gonna put everything. Uh, we don't need more lamps. So, oh, we can have put one there actually. And one in the bathroom. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm all kinds of having a cold or something. Uh, a fire alarm, we already have one, good. And then this will be their bedroom. And the parents bedroom and this little diploma whatever it is oh that was an extra light wasn't it and uh, we already have one of those uh, we don't have one of these uh, this is a nice sink I think I don't know uh, this is a duplicate this is what happens when you take everything from your last apartment. <laughs> oh, I put that backwards. Okay, I'll, I'll fix it soon. Okay, and this one can go here maybe. We can have a nice little reading nook there. We'll probably have to use this. Wait. Okay, so this one is less nice, I think. I'm gonna go into build mode. Because this one, yes, this is this one. And this one is that one. Okay, so I'm gonna sell that one. And they can keep that. And one of these sinks are, like, do they give better hygiene or something? Okay, yeah, so this we can have a, is this a kitchen sink? I don't know. Well, I'm gonna keep that. And we're gonna sell all these. And then, I think that they, they um, oh dear, now they have a lot of money. <laughs> it was good to move here. So obviously they have enough money to buy a bed for a 
a sibling for the the kid. So which one? This one maybe. Are we having a color theme in there? Somehow, I don't know. Oh, this is awful. <laughs> uh, better bedspread, please. Like, this white one is not bad. But the frame, the frame doesn't match at all. No. Let's just have this white one instead. It's not white though, is it? But it's so much better matching. So wait, when the kid gets a bit older, we could put a bed here. But they also want a new baby. But that's that's a later problem. We could put we could even put the crib out here for now. Or for, or for later, I don't know. It could be there. You would li like never put a crib like that in reality, but maybe here by the window. How? What is it? You shouldn't put the baby by the window, or you like if it. I don't know. It could be, get hot. We could be, we could do that. Do they have a changing table? I don't think they do. <laughs> And I'm gonna do something that I forget to do <laughs> too, because where is it? Aspiration rewards. Do they have any? Uh, Gavin has some. Oh dear, he has unlocked uh, exactly eight of these. So he is supposed to have a secondary aspiration. So we're gonna see. First off, he's a Sagittarius. I have now. I I think I have a system for this. Okay. So he's a Sagittarius. So. And he, what is he a knowledge sim? Yes. And the rules say that Sagittarius is fortune sim. So that's one possibility. But we're also going to do, we're gonna go into the secondary aspiration calculator like this. And we're gonna find his interests. <laughs> <clears throat> and he has three uh, crime, five, food, 10, sports, four, work, five, and school is outside the picture. What? Seven. Why? School is seven. Money? He is not interested in money. Uh, entertainment 10. Health 3. Paranormal 9. Weather 5. <laughs> and toys is 3. Toys 3. Why is it doing that? It usually doesn't do that. Uh, env environment 7, culture 10, fashion 7, travel 0, animals 4, and sci-fi is 7. Okay, good. So his secondary aspiration could be pleasure. So we have, what did I say, pleasure or what was what was the other one? What is this? All right. Oh, what? Uh, I'm all confused now. Pleasure of fortune. So then we go into the stats tab <laughs> here, and we can see that we have. How do I forget everything? It was fortune or pleasure. Okay, and we see that we have less pleasure sims. So that's, then we're gonna go with the pleasure, I think. 
And, you know, maybe he's been pretty focused so far. He's been going to college and everything. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So maybe he, he uh, decides that now it's time for me to have some pleasure. <laughs> I'm not too sure about this, but this is what I did. Yes, he is now a secondary pleasure. So he he's like knowledge and pleasure, uh, which is pretty weird. That's what happened. And he he wants to gain a cleaning skill point so he can oops he can go over here and study cleaning for a little bit wait i need to fix the day uh the day should be they are on thursday with two days left of autumn okay let's fix that fast First, let's, what did I say? Thursday? <laughs> did I say Thursday? I am all over the place today with my brain. Set season th uh, two and set season length two. There we go. So now it's Thursday and it's autumn. <laughs> I wish I could do that in reality. There. Also, I want to put these somewhere more. Better. And we, oh, and we need a computer. They had this one. Maybe now I can put that there yes can I put this oh I can put that there now they don't hit, take any space in the kitchen awesome uh, we need to decorate the walls too Ugh. well I think the children should be in there for now So much to do because they <clears throat> they need to try for baby and they need to invite uh, the orphan orphanage over. <coughs> I think they need a dining table of some kind. Well, this is pretty. This is good. There. <coughs> How did I put that? Wait. Okay, we need chairs. And then let's go with these ones. These go with everything, right? <laughs> and we should have some more stuff for the kid, I think. We need one of these. Can I put it here or will that be a problem? I don't know if they can use it there. I like to have it there. Not sure if that's a good idea. We need a little potty. I'm gonna put that over there. And we need some toys. Hmm, I'm filling the space up again. <laughs> well, I kind of want a changing table too. It will have to be over here. I don't think you can put, I don't know. I was allowed to put that there, so. Um, 
We need a xylophone because The Sims 4 doesn't have a xylophone. It's very important that we have one. I'm going to put it in that corner over there. And then for charisma, we have the little rabbit's head. Like a so. And these two makes a lot of sound, so it's good to have them out here. <clears throat> or maybe we can put the rabbit's head there. I don't know. Maybe that's a horrible idea. We'll see. But then we need some good floorings. What they have. Maybe some, like... Is it too much? I think it's too much. Hmm. I kind of like this. Ah, uh, no. This is kind of nice too. Do we have rugs in this game? I don't remember. <laughs> Let's see if there's rugs. There is rugs. Um, oh, well, this isn't too bad. Oops. What? Okay, I'm going to look up the, the cheat code for placing on half tiles, because I think that would be awesome. Let's see. Um, Sims 2 place half tile. Set quarter tile placement tile. After you enter the sheet, set quarter tile placement on. You can toggle it on and off with control F. Really? Isn't that what triangles? So if I press F, no, is it control F? Oh, it's control F. So I can move these two <laughs> spots over. No, the table won't go there. Why? Because I want the table over here. Why isn't it? Oh, <clears throat> this is in the way. Why doesn't the table work? I want to put the table over there. Huh. Okay, now it works for some reason. <coughs> Where's my grid? <laughs> I don't know if this is right. Wait, so this is a head, whole tile. One, two. So this should be the right placement then. And this, one, two. Because I think this will make the chairs work. And this looks so much better. Wait, will this work? We need to... Well, that one didn't. <laughs> Why not? Well, is this right? No. I think that is it. No. What is wrong with this chair? Wait. Okay. So this is all the way. Wait, wait, wait. One, two, three, four. Four, one, two. That's where it should go, I think. There it went. Okay, good. So now they should be able to use all of this. This looks very nice. I'm going to save. And then we just need some floorings. Um, you know what, like, I like carpets. <laughs> I feel we have, like, sort of a yellow tone in here. If that's too much. And that's too awful. That will work. And I wish, I, I actually wish, like, this, it, it looks so nice with carpets. And I, I'm putting it in 
like when I was little, everyone had, had them. They were so nice to walk on. But now that I'm an adult, I understand how dirty they must become. So we don't put them in anymore, but I still miss it. All right, they have like sort of a purple bedspread. Should I use these? No, doesn't match. Maybe this one. I don't know what that pattern is, but I kind of like this. Oh, they have two lamps. We don't need two lamps. <laughs> there we go. And then some nice wall paintings in here, maybe. This is, hmm. Hmm. I feel like this is Probably more like an accent wall that we could put over there. I don't know about that. Um, I don't think it really goes. I don't think so. I think this is more of the vibe. And it seems like I'm painting the entire apartment. I want a different pattern in the kitchen. Maybe we do some tiles in the kitchen. Oh, this this wallpaper. I could have this in real life. I like it. I really like it. Well, maybe I put it on this wall too. There. And then we can have some tiles on the other parts. There. Uh, tile. Oh, it's a fairly yellow kitchen. No. This kind of works. Let's have it like that. Should we have some curtains over there? Like, I never put any curtains. But maybe we should do that now. But we should also have... A wall with something here. Uh, this! <laughs> That's crazy. No. This is not very nice, but I kind of liked it anyway. If I put this, it's sort of bare. And it really shows that I haven't put anything up on the wall. So maybe I maybe I actually use this for the children's room. Like it's kind of awful, but that's that's just what happened. Okay. We are <clears throat> going out of character for me and doing curtains. I never do that. Um and <clears throat> because I never do that, I haven't downloaded uh, many curtains. As you can see, this works. Maybe I just put these. Um, if I put move objects on and do this, will that pose a problem? I don't know. On. I'm gonna put them there anyway. They don't seem to have a dresser, do they? Don't know. Does this work or does it look like it goes through the counter, which it does? I kind of like it. These are automatic. I wish they were nicer. Oh, wait, we could do these. These are kitcheny. I don't know why they would use these awful patterns, but it seems it seems like what they do. We don't put them here because they will catch fire. 
there you go. I think that's it. I don't know. Let's save. And the next family that moves in here will have to deal with the, these um, wall coverings and things. Wait, I forgot the... I, I forgot the this bit. <laughs> the bathroom. We're gonna have tiles of some kind. Oh, red. That's cool. They're so small, so like we could put pretty bold colors in here, I, I feel. And now we need... No, why, why am I changing category? We are going into tiles. We could even do bricks. I think that's kind of fun to do sometimes. Like this. But that one, not that one. This is sort of like industrial looking. Maybe we just switch out some of them. Like that. <laughs> that's, that's fun. I don't know. Like it's so. <coughs> there you go. That's what they chose. Okay, can we play now? <laughs> I don't know what I forgot to buy for them. Does she have anything in her inventory though? No, she doesn't. She wants a kitten or a puppy. She can't decide, so she's not doing anything now. I think they're gonna start with trying for baby though. She can go and relax and actually he will have to wait with his cl cleaning skill. They, they will both go and relax, put the baby down there, that's good. Oh, and Bruno, what is he about? He is a Scorpio. And they are destined to be fortune sims, if they figure that out, which they don't always do. Oh, and also, um, with my, my new system that I... Wait, is that even right? I feel like if we go here and see pleasure, it says five. Oh, it doesn't count with the secondary aspiration pleasure. It should do, though because secondary aspirations are pretty much equal. I should, I should change that. Oh, it incre increases. Did it? Wait. Oh, I, I did already do that. Okay, I am counting secondary respiration, but I don't always uh, mark it down what they have. So I don't think Brittany has a secondary respiration, but she has unlocked eight of these. So her next, um, her next, what is it? Benefit will be her secondary respiration. Don't sit in that chair. It, it will be fine. We did good on the decorating, didn't we? This, this is good. Uh, do they have work? Forgot. She's unemployed and he has work at 11. So maybe Brittany will handle the adoption herself. I think, because I don't think there will be very much time. And he works until 6 p.m. So, yeah. They will just have their little, oh, look, look how decorated and everything is now that I put curtains in. I never put curtains in, I keep forgetting. Oh my goodness, what is going on? I'm gonna have a picture. They look dead inside. I always take pictures like that. I forget to wait until they have facial expressions. <laughs> uh, but, oh, break up? No, that's not what she wants to do. She wants to try for baby. 
and we're gonna mark in the spreadsheet. Um, I'm gonna put it over here and put on her. Try for baby one is on Thursday. There you go. So the rules are they're only allowed to try for baby once each day and only the one with the want to have a baby will do it unless uh, they do it via ACR, which happens. And uh, uh, we, we need an ACR adjuster, I just realized. Uh, adjust casual romance spawn adjuster, and we're gonna put it as a. Hmm. I got stuff on all the tables. Maybe we can switch that out. Change model to an orchid. And we can remove this. Put that there instead. Now it doesn't take it up any un uh, unnecessary space. That's good. Um, they also don't have a dresser. It, we can put a small one. Wait. Because um, I need them to, to get dressed now. <laughs> we can use this one. It's very small and handy and I think we can put this one there instead and put put it there there you go and now she can change into every day oh well they, they look less dead inside now <laughs> so I'm gonna take a picture <laughs> I'm hopeless um, and with the nice little flowers in the corner. Nice. Nice, nice. And I also forgot to buy them a phone. I think. Does she have a... She doesn't have a cell phone. I've looked at in her inventory like five times now. I should know. Uh, don't sleep. And the way we do this is... Um, yeah, they need a phone, otherwise no one can call them. But I'm not going to use the phone. Where do we put the... I think we can have it like, like this, and they can still use it. I, I think... I think that works. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Oh, she's so in love. Well, he's going to go to work soon. I'm not going to bother with him. But we also do need a teleporter. Um, this one I might delete after. I'm going to put it here for now. I would like to put it outside. But I don't think I can. No. <laughs> It will just be over there and then we're gonna summon uh, from the orphanage if I can find it um, where did it go I'm I'm blind seems is it not with big letters is that why I can't find it maybe I just wrote orphanage so many there it is uh, and we're gonna summon Shelby over because she's the intendant so we're gonna uh, talk to her first and Gavin, he can just <clears throat> like change into every day because he's going to go to work soon. Hello. <clears throat> How did you get in here? I usually put the, the teleporter as a shrub and I have it outside. 
Also, I forgot to put ceilings in, but that's too late now. Um, um, I keep using that functionality. It's not very good. There. But uh, we'll just pretend that she came in through the door. Maybe if I put this closer to the door, it will look more natural. <laughs> put it in the bookcase. That's fine. And we're going to summon. And now we have quite a few options here. And it's uh, a bit complicated. Let's see here. Now, it costs extra to adopt a toddler or a baby, so we're not going to bother with those because we're really... So we, we're going we're gonna to have one of these. So we're going to uh, randomize three of them that we get a chance on. <laughs> so it's 13 to 17. So we go to random.org. Random.org. <clears throat> what did I say? Oh, thank you so much. Uh, oh, wow. <laughs> it's, a, it's a raid. <laughs> thought it was a follow. Well, welcome here. Hello. We are um, being in my spreadsheet right now. And we are going to uh, adopt someone from the orphanage. So that is what it is going on. And we are randomizing who we're going to summon over. So we got Sina uh, first. Sina, so welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good time today. <clears throat> Here's little Sina and we're going to talk to her. Talk. Uh, you should really try to, <laughs> to start a spreadsheet. Yes. Um, my recommendation for that is just uh, don't start here. <laughs> you know, just start with household, first name, last name, and then like maybe age. And then just add as you go. Like add old columns. When you think you need columns, just add them. You'll end up with a big spreadsheet. <laughs> but you know, don't do, don't do it all at once. It will be horrible. I learned how to do spreadsheets because of playing The Sims 2. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I have I have quite a lot of filters and stuff that I wouldn't know about if I didn't have a need from playing Sims 2. But we are going to back, go back to random.org and see the second kid is also 16. No, 15. So we get row 15, that's Nicole. So we're gonna summon her over. It was a useful for creating things even. Yes, um, spreadsheets um, skills are awesome. Uh, companies really appreciate when you're, when you're uh, good with those too. So it's a good skill to have. 14. Uh, oh, Amy Jones. So we are summoning over Amy. And she got sits on her face. <laughs> but that's fine. So uh, since Gavin is going to work, I'm, I, I think like he's going to say, I don't think he has a relationship with any of these kids. Well, he could try. He could try uh, before he goes to work. But yeah, he's gonna put clothes on first. They just tried for baby <laughs> too. <laughs> so. Stop talking to Shelby. Now we're gonna know that uh, it's about like 20 to 10. So this is going to go on until... Um, 20 to 1. Yes. Uh, they have three hours to do this, and we're gonna not ask them to leave. Chat with them. Oh, and we we need to make them selectable because otherwise they might leave. <laughs> so at least Sina makes selectable. 
Nicole and Amy. Amy might miss school uh, from this, but you know, it's, it's, it's what it is. And she's going to talk to Nicole too. So we queued that up. And Gavin is going to put clothes on. And then after three hours, we just uh, sum, sum up who they like the best. And then we, we take that one. So he's going to go over here and try to talk to little Nicole. And then he can talk to Sina. And Amy. I don't know if he's going to be have time to talk to all of them. What are you doing? Talk to Amy. See now Gavin has to go. Well, and he has talked to, to Nicole, so that's... Hmm. I don't know if I'm gonna count his wishes because it's gonna be skewed. <laughs> Usually I just let them talk like uh, until they stop and then we'll see how they get along with everyone. Well, actually, Gavin, you can just go and I'm not gonna care what you think. I'm gonna, just gonna pick one of these kids. <laughs> uh, so Amy... Oh my goodness, where are you? <gasps> Oh, okay, so I think the try for baby thing worked. And now I don't have any idea what, which, which kid to talk to in what order, but that's fine. Where did Nicole go? Well, we can do this, see where she went. She's over here now, where are you going? What are you doing? We don't know. And we're going to talk to you too. Oh, here comes little Coral, Coral Broke. Uh, she has very similar hairstyle <laughs> to Nicole. So they may, they they could be friends, you know, because they have the same hairstyle. That, that's how that works, right? <laughs> Okay, are you talking to people? Oh, she's reading to the kid. Well, I like that. So I kind of hope she picks Amy. I think um, that, that would be really nice. Because Amy, Amy is just like some townie, I think, that I put in into the orphanage for some reason. <laughs> I can't remember, but she's dating Lester Pleasant, so it would be nice to have her in the family, I think. So we better keep track of the time. Oh, and we also better keep track so that Brittany doesn't die from starvation. I don't think it will happen. Oh, and there's Betty Broke too. They have become children. Um, little Coral Bet and Betty. Uh, why are they here though? Shouldn't they be in school? Well, when you move, uh, you move in at eight o'clock in the morning. And that's uh, very not ha so handy because eight o'clock is when the bus comes for this school. Oh, now she needs to run away again. And so when you, they move in at exactly eight o'clock, you the game doesn't trigger that event and none of the children go to school. So you need to send them like manually. Uh, but obviously no one sent these <laughs> the kids. Oh, well, Technically, Sina is close, so she, she sh should talk to her, um, maybe. I don't know. We'll see how, who she picks at the end. 
But it's it's very not handy when she goes to throw up all the time. <laughs> How are we doing? Uh, we are... Well, so far Amy is uh, in the lead because she has 10 and the other ones don't. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. She seems to get along quite well with, with Xena too. Oh, now she has 13 with Xena. And oh, should we care what Bruno thinks? Because Bruno, he likes uh, Amy quite a lot. He dislikes Nicole. So yeah, since since Amy is reading to Bruno all the time, I think like that counts, right? Oh, here comes Bob the third, little Bobby Sartor. He is the child of uh, Brandy Broke, or like, sh she remarried <laughs> with Cory Sartor and had little Bobby here. Um, uh, I think the time is up, actually. Um, all right, so. Uh, I'm gonna have to use the spreadsheet now because she has 10, I don't, wait, she has 10 with Amy uh, and 13 with Sina, but Bruno uh, doesn't know Sina at all and she has, he has 6 with Amy, so if we add 6 to 10, that's 16, right? And then Amy wins. <laughs> I really, I really wanted it to be Amy too. So what we are going to do is we're gonna make unselectable all visitors, but then we're gonna do move in Amy. There we go, and we're going to adopt Amy. Uh, but before I do that, I need to check. She doesn't have a family tree at all. But she does now. So we're going to adopt Amy. And now we have, she has parents. Hooray. Uh, and she wants to go to college. So she wants to like run to school probably. So we're gonna, I'm gonna try and send her. Um, if I can, I'm not sure I can. It's a little bit too late to go to school because school's out at one, so I don't think she can do that now. No, she will have to miss this school day. She wants to be friends with Cornelius too. Like, all right. That's cool. Uh, so what we're gonna have to do now is sort of the finances. We're gonna pay a thousand simoleons for the adoption. So bank online, uh, transmit money to household funds, playable, a thousand, not three thousand, like I did earlier. <laughs> okay, stop talking to Nicole now. Like if they adopt again, uh, Nicole is a good candidate, even though Bruno does, doesn't like her at all. Oh, little Cena. I, I think she, she thought like that this would be nice, but she didn't get it. <laughs> she, she didn't win the popularity contest or whatever you say. Okay. She will have to wait for the next family that wants to adopt. The reason I, like, earlier, I didn't adopt them immediately. I just, um... Well, actually, I'm gonna keep that there. I might need it. 
um, I, ju I just kept them as foster children, but I figured out like I had this uh, jump bug glitch thing that happens sometimes when children get back from school and I figured out that it's when I googled and one person said it's a problem that occurs when you have children that do not live with any of their parents. And I went like, what? Would, why would that matter? But then I realized when they get good enough grade, they bring home a report card that they want to show to a parent. And the game doesn't handle that when the, when the parent isn't present. So they, the child doesn't know where to go and, um, and it glitches out and it's, it causes that jump bug and they don't get homework and it's awful. So now I uh, immediately adopt them and we don't have that problem. I hope. That's a theory. That's my theory. <laughs> All right. So we are transmitting to Shelby. There we go. And then we're also going to... Um, deposit quite a lot here. We're depositing 5,000 because we, we can have them there. We also have bills, unfortunately, and they might be a little bit higher because I didn't deposit the money. But anyway, now she has 5,000 in her bank account. And like, Oh, not 500, 5,000. And, but Gavin has zero. And I guess we have a loan. Where did I put the loan jar? Loan info. Yes. We could pay all that back. And I think we should actually. Okay, let let's pay back as much as we can, because they don't they're not short on money. I think there's a mod either named Tuna is a fish or by a creator with a name that's supposed to fix that. Tuna, <laughs> tuna is a fish. <laughs> All right. Well, it is a fish is a fish sims 2 well it, it seems that you are right i think uh, that there is a creator I, I will look into it later but that would be good but for now I, i'm just uh, actually adopting <laughs> children <laughs> But I, I will look into that. Oh, that would be so good if that stopped happening because it's really annoying when it happens. Uh, Marissa Bendit has uh, gone rogue, I think. I think she was military before. But now she doesn't look military, does she? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh. She needs to go... We could say goodbye to all of these people now. We don't need them here. Oh well, maybe maybe they like linger around as long as they want because you know Shelby figures like relationships are good or something like that. I don't know. Oh now Amy is in the toilet. Gosh darn teens and their toilet needs. Um, what was I doing? Oh, finances. Right, right, right. Um, more bank online. What was the loan? The loan was like 1,200, I think. So if we withdraw 2,000, we should be able to repay it. Still have some money. Bills are 420, that's quite a lot. And we can, where's Gavin? 420. Brittany doesn't have a job and she doesn't have a wish to get a job currently. 
She has won six grandchildren. Oh well. Uh, but Gavin has 690. See, work days per week, five. We're not having this. So, well, this seems like it will. What? Oh, this this is not right. <laughs> okay. There. Do we have Amy in here? Amy. No, doesn't matter. We are though going to move Amy to the right family now and 24 there auto sort there we go she has a towny token like obviously but she wants to be friends with Cornelius. He should be home, maybe. Wait, he went to, to uh, university. But we can try. Oh my goodness, she has an F. That That is not good. <laughs> well, um, if she gets taken away, I'm, I'm gonna transport her back. <laughs> Because th this is not fair for her. Well, uh, see, she is like in love with Lester Pleasant, or she has a crush at least. But now she wants to talk to Cornelius. Just talk to him. For some reason, I don't know why. But that is. Oh, she wants to have a party too. She's a popularity sim, so she wants lots and lots of friends. Really? I thought she was a family sim, but apparently not. Grade school is rough. Yeah. I don't remember why her grades are like that. Oh, wait. She might have a zero. In... Like, okay, so the grade is stored like... Uh, I think it's an inju integer or something I don't I'm not sure about that but uh, when there when it's the, when the grade is not set then it's uh, no it's nothing and the game when you start a game it interprets that as zero and it's an F and it's bad <laughs> so <laughs> um, yeah we, we should pay these bills oh uh, also pay back entire loan there now they don't have a loan, that is very good. Why did they have a loan? I'm not sure. Um, no loan. Why is my phone making noises? I'm not sure. Fingerprint does not match. Well, that is my fingerprint, I promise. Oh, that's... Twitch is running in the background. I have no idea. Did I get no notifications? I don't know. It keeps making noises. <laughs> well, hopefully Amy goes to school in a good mood uh, tomorrow. And she has... Um, no, no undone homework over here, so her grades should improve, I think. Oh my god, she wants, she really wants a pet. Does anyone else want a pet? Gavin also wants a pet. Um, well, I guess we'll randomize then. Amy, get off the phone. <laughs> I, I need to use the phone to get a pet. After I go and have a little pee. 
but I'm pretty sure she's pregnant. I'm gonna note. Uh, I'm gonna keep the adopt question mark here, and I'm gonna put pregnant. Well, question mark because we haven't received the baby bump, but I'm fairly sure she's pregnant. <laughs> Wait, no one is taking care of Bruno. What is happening with this kid? He wants to learn to walk and he is dirty and a little bit hungry. So we need to, you know, fix that. Well, maybe Amy does that. Uh, change his diaper and put him in the chair. Because she seemed like very interested in, in uh, taking care of little Bruno. And now... They're siblings. Come on, Bruno. Oh, I haven't taken a picture of her yet. Aww. Look how pretty she is. She's like one of the prettiest uh, sims in my game. I think Gina Shibata is also very pretty. <laughs> well, I have a lot of pretty sims. But I, I really like Amy. She's very pretty. And now that Amy's off the phone, we can call service and see if we can uh, get a little pet for ourselves. They really are filling up this apartment. Oh, stop. Stop making noise. I, I bet uh, Dustin is having a party in there. Um, pet adoption service. Remember to save the game. That is a good idea. I keep forgetting, but I usually save at six o'clock because uh, that is uh, updating the spreadsheet time. All right, so she did want a puppy or kitten, so we're looking. Here's three puppies, um, and here's two puppies, so that's five, and here's. Four four, five, so there's ten small pets. <laughs> so we are randomizing one of those, not hundred, ten, and we get number eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we're having this one. <laughs> but now we, so, so then we know it's a cat we could choose one of the other cats but maybe we just take this one this is what the one we got what should we name it um we could name it spreadsheet <laughs> no wait random cat name i have done this before Yes, give me, give me something. Uh, is, is it, which it should be, it should be a female. There. Why am I not allowed to submit now? Female, yes. Uh, Miss Agile. Okay. Hmm. We can't we can't name it Amy because we just adopted a human Amy. That won't. Mrs. Amusing. Miss Nimblefoot. That's that's cute. I don't know. Maybe we do that. Miss Nimblefoot. There you go. Would you uh, want to adopt Miss Nimblefoot? Yes. <laughs> And we are going to have to extract some more monies now because bank online withdraw. Uh, I don't know how much I need. Two thousand. I'm gonna use up all their money. <laughs> don't you worry. <laughs> Not a merry cat names. Oh yeah. Because we, we can afford the cat, 
but we can't afford uh, the accessories. Uh, bank online, withdraw. Two thousand. You're in the way. Here she is now. That should give her some points. Three of them. <laughs> now she's in platinum, and when a sim is in platinum, that's when we care about uh, the lifetime wish. But Brittany is uh, well on her way to do that anyway. We we have done all we can already. <laughs> So, okay, uh, now she wants to be friends with Miss Nimblefoot. Well, this cat is not married, she's a miss. <laughs> hey, I was just looking through my phone book, how are things going? Okay, people miss everyone. Thank you. But I need to get money out of my bank account. Bank online, withdraw. Uh, two thousand. Hello, little kitty. Oh, we'll have to try and get the cat inside too. Did she feed the baby? I don't think she. F oh, maybe this doesn't work. Maybe we can't have it there. No, it doesn't work. Uh, that's what I thought, but I wasn't sure. Well, maybe we put the bookcase over here and we can put the chair like there. Place Bruno in chair. And you can feed him. Aww. <laughs> oh, look at that. She really wanted a pet. She's so happy now. There. I, I wish the camera wouldn't do that every time I took a picture, but that, that's what happens. <laughs> There's a mod for that too. For what? For the camera? Doing weirdness? Or... There's a mod for almost anything. <laughs> That's what's so great about The Sims, that everyone made mods and we can have whatever we like, really. Oh, Brittany is starving to death. That's not good. Well, get... What is happening now? Is the, is the dog in the way? How is the dog in the way? All right, well, serve dinner. To make, make high shares accessible from all angles. Oh, that would be nice. Um, I think we're gonna have spaghetti. Stop that. Amy is losing enthusiasm some about music and dance. What is her hobby then? Do we know? It's science. Well, Amy, I don't know if we can fit anything in here, but these people doesn't seem to automatically leave. I'm not sure. Maybe they hang around. I don't know. Here comes Angela Sartor. All right. You know what happened? <laughs> I said Brandy married Corey Sartor, right? Well, Angela kind of stole him away. <laughs> she left Dustin and uh, married Corey. Oh, Corey is over here. He is uh, a criminal. <laughs> well, so, so Angela left Dustin and married uh, Corey Sartor instead. And now, they live in here, Angela and Corey and the kids. Uh, and Dustin lives here with Meadow, so it's interesting. <laughs> yeah. 
Well, I'm making food for everyone. And the cat toys will have to wait because uh, Brittany cannot starve to death just because the cat needs food. Oh, the cat will need food too. Ah! <laughs> what a safe apartment complex. Um, yes. <laughs> well, actually, if, if uh, all the robbers live here, then we shouldn't get robbed, right? Because you don't rob your own, <laughs> you know? <laughs> so that should be quite safe. <laughs> I don't know. I, you, you wouldn't, like, rob your neighbor because... Um, oh, Miss Nimblefoot has a problem. Well, we're gonna reset her. What is happening? Oh, she did that. All right, okay. Well, I know how to fix it. It's really easy. We just lock these doors. Uh, disallow pets. Lock disallow pets. Because what happens is uh, there's something wrong with pets in my game. When they think about or like when they try to decide to go lay on a bed, they might glitch out and sink into the floor. So we just lock the bedroom doors for them. So they can't be in there. And it's fine. But before I figured that out, it was quite a nuisance. <laughs> I My game is um, having some... Oh, are you serving food out here? Well, uh, it's a nice day, I guess. It's kind of overcast. We can fix that. <laughs> I think it's in here. Um, no. Maybe it's in here. There it is. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna randomize the sky now. <laughs> so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There. Wait. I'm gonna have to do this in one go. And one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's eight and six. It's gonna make sense in a in a second. So first eight. So six and five so we're gonna go do six five so okay one two three four five six one two three four five and then we just put this somewhere and right about now i want to put back my move object on was it already on i don't know i'm gonna put it inside this cabinet or maybe, you know, it doesn't work. Because the phone is there. There. Wait. There. It, this will not be visible when I play. Where did the phone go? There it is. There. And now we have... Wait. Maybe I don't like that sky. It's like a night sky during the day. Well, mm, That's not what I want. And it's cheaper to to rebuy it. Okay, so we'll we'll do this again. Eight four three Let's try again. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. Uh um, this time I'm gonna... What is wrong with the sky? I don't like it. <laughs> no, have another one. We, I could just choose the one I want. <laughs> one, two. What, where's the fun in that? I don't know. One, two. What does that look like? Uh, okay, well... That's that's okay, I guess. Now we gotta do that thing again. There. What did I say about the sky? Was it nice? Uh, well, not really. Well, what that will do is it will move. 
<laughs> it will move around and it will look a little bit more alive. That's where we why we put it. But it is we are living quite close to uh, the factories and everything over there, so that's why the sky is not good over here. <laughs> I guess. Oh, you serving food to everyone before yourself. Well, that's very noble of you. And everyone aged. Let's see. So now, I'm gonna do that over there. Now, Gavin is 37. Brittany is 30. Yay! And Amy is 10. And that's weird. Well, uh, Bruno is 5. And he grows up in one day. Well, the reason why Amy is just 10, even though she's a teen, is because the game says she ages up in 11 days. And that's just the way she came. And I'm not aging her up. like So she has like quite an extra time. But I'm treating it, uh, her as a teen, even though like her numeric age is very low we are pretending that she is actually a teenager because otherwise what she and Dustin uh, no uh, what she and Lester has been doing is quite wrong but you know we can clearly see that she's a teen <laughs> so there's nothing wrong I hope well She still wants to be friends with Cornelius, so well, you know, after after dinner she might call him again. Did get Gavin guest get home? Oh my goodness, are you working in that? What are your job? Run ta run table night. Oh my goodness, she's an early bloomer. I guess. <laughs> well, the whole thing makes me a little bit uncomfortable, but you know. <laughs> It's the game, it, it does things. And he was promoted to a juggler. Well, I get, I, um, I'm guessing he thinks it's very nice to not having to wear this anymore to work. It's quite heavy. His lifetime want is to become, uh, to get to the top of this career. So it makes sense. He wants to gain a cleaning skill point still. Don't know why, but that's what he wants to do, and he wants to find a roommate. We don't have room for a roommate, so don't do that. Um, he wants to buy a stereo. Well, what I I want to buy things for the cat. So that's what I'm gonna do. Because we need it. Here we can have... Can I put it here? Like, it looks so much better. Like so. Will this work? Oh, and... <laughs> we can't just hold... If I put this here, will it work? Because then it takes up way less space. I'm not sure this is going to work, though. But we'll... We'll try to have it like that. And we can have this one over here. Mm, I don't know if that will be in the way to get out here. I don't know. Maybe I don't put one of those. Maybe we just have a little mouse toy thing. I think they destroy these after a while though. I ran out of space again. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna put it there. Mm, we have that. We need. Oh, we need a litter box. Where should I put that? Oh dear. I. Hmm. Well, do we want that in the kitchen? I don't think we want that. But what choices do we have? Maybe we put that in the corner instead. Like so. And it won't be so much in everyone's face. We need a little cat bed. Do cats sleep in this one? So quite 
large. I was watching Pleasant Sims and she had a much nicer cat bed. Now I'm sad that I don't have it. I don't I don't think I have room for this. Well I could go over here, I guess. Wait. Ah This looks like it would work. I don't I'm not sure. We're gonna have routing errors all over the place. Well, let's try it. We'll, we'll have to remove it if it's in the way. And he could like uh, pick up this pet. We need to get it inside. Oh my goodness. Parsley Long has... <laughs> this is Parsley. It's the son of Benjamin Long. He accidentally turned into a plant sim and he spawned this little boy here. <laughs> and apparently he is uh, out exercising. What is on his shirt? It's a little text over there. Huh. Okay, can you put... Can you go there without putting the cat down? Sometimes they put the cat down and it's very annoying. Because what we're doing is carrying it inside because kittens can't get upstairs. Well, he put it there. Oh, that, that's fine. Fill this bowl. And also, you should come say hi to Amy. You could eat this. Oh, he's not hungry. He can encourage playfulness. I guess. Wait, what's his... Uh, he's very active. That's like his main feature. So, but I couldn't encourage activeness activity okay so he, he's gonna encourage that in others i have decided well i'm gonna save again so i don't remember when i saved <clears throat> oh, hello, new daughter of mine. Should we keep her hair like this? Well, it's her style. I, um, I, don't, I don't want to change her too much. Well, I don't think she responded well to that. So well, we can talk to her a little bit, because I don't feel like he knows her at all. <laughs> Maybe he doesn't like her at all. The worst thing that could happen is like if they really dislike each other, uh, they might have to like return her to the orphanage. That would be unfortunate. What are you doing? Oh, the cat is on the bed. Oh, good. So that works. Oh, and then I was worried about this chair when I put this toy behind it, and it seems to work well. That's good. Oh, what are you doing now? Well, they're happy, I guess. <laughs> they're going to relax. But I don't think you need to try it for baby Brittany. I think it's fine. She's gonna do a casual woohoo. See, we can't we can't try for baby, so you know. <laughs> oof. What oof? I don't know. Uh Amy wants to have a party, so maybe she Throws a party. Oh, we can throw a birthday party because uh, Bruno is about to age up, isn't he? Well, I haven't. I have been sort of neglecting him, um, but you know, he. he um, yeah, we'll just have a party for him. <laughs> 
Oh, and of course she's going to inv invite Lester, but then she's also going to invite Cornelis. Um, let's let's uh, try and have the teens and hmm, first. Oop, returning her to the orphanage if they don't get along. Yeah, that, that would be not good. We'll have to, to make sure they like each other somehow. How? Should I just invite whoever she wants? I'm suddenly not sure. Well, Angela and Corey are neighbors, so we invite Angela. I don't know. We can't invite anymore, so that's that's fine. The guests are all invited. Make clean this up. There you go. And now she's in platinum. Her lifetime wants is to become mayor. That's ambitious. So, uh, well, I don't know how to work on that right now. I don't think she can get a job because uh, of her grade, but we could... Oh dear, she has quite a lot of skills. We could work on those, so then if she goes to college, she will have an easier time. Nicole and I are leaving since it's so late and way past bedtime. Yeah, that makes sense. Wait, we should invite a nuisance. We should. Uh, call Sim. Um, we could invite Georgia. But I was I was thinking about Ginger and all that. All of them. They're not friends. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna call Ginger. We could call. We like Seth better, apparently, and he lives in the same house. Or William. We like William. So if I invite household, will he come? Because it's quite late. Well, it seems like they will come. Ah, oh, no, we can't get all of them over here. Oh, well, screw you, John. <laughs> Let's just invite some of them then. <laughs> there we go. Now we can buy a birthday cake. Poor little Bruno will not have a really good uh, upbringing, but that's that's just what it is. I'm just gonna wait for them to arrive. Is the party started yet? There we go. Party is started. There we go. Do I need to invite them in now? They just walk right in since there's a party going on. There we go. Delmar is... What are you doing, Delmar? <laughs> I don't know. Well, these two are like inseparable. So... And now they're both adopted, like uh, Lester got adopted by um, Jennifer Pleasant. She, she retook her name when John left her. Uh, so she was Jennifer Burb, but now she's Jennifer Pleasant again. And she adopted uh, Lester. So now he is Lester Pleasant. But he, he already was that, because he got uh, adopted by Lilith Pleasant first. 
but you know she died and then Cassandra died and then <laughs> it was all messy what is happening oh I'm very excited I try this science activity oh so both Amy wait Amy and Bruno like science they have that in common so I think they are gonna get along fine. Let's bring Bruno to cake. And let's hope the camera angles are going to be good. I'm saving a lot today. <laughs> it's been through so much. Yes, Lester has not had an easy time. But now like he's uh, finally like adopted properly uh, in a stable home because you know Jennifer is quite stable even though she kind of accidentally got all her children taken away earlier but that's fine <laughs> and he is like 17 so he's going to go to college very soon so he's quite uh, older than Amy but yeah I think that they are going to have a little bit of a pause in their relationship soon. <laughs> but she's very, very in love with him. There we go. Little Bruno is aging up. He wants to be played with by Brittany. We can lock that in. Actually, no, I'm not going to lock anything in. Remember to save your game. Well, I just saved, so I'm not going to do that right now. Yay! Let's see what he looks like as a child. There we go. Oh, this is a good camera angle. Nothing is blocking the view at all. <laughs> so, <laughs> and the dirty toilet, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let me. Oh, they're going at it. Oh, you can clearly see his the son of Gavin. You know, you can see the resem resemblance. Gavin looks a bit weird, I think, but no, it's okay. There we go. Now he needs a bed. We don't have a baby yet. They they are going to have to move soon again. Well, maybe soon they can afford a house actually, so that they can like fit all their children. I don't know. We need to put a bed in here. How am I? How am I going to fit everything? Maybe we'll have to stash this away, like so, and we can have this here, and we can have another bed in here this room is very boring it's just two beds but you know we could put this like this and then we can have a little toy box that will be nice wait Bruno has, wait, I, I want to see his everyday clothes, but I think his favorite color is going to be like blue or turquoise or something. Where are you going with that? Oh, <laughs> gonna throw it away. Okay. Well, Amy, didn't you want to be friends with Cornelius? Shouldn't you talk to him? Is he here even? Wait, what is happening over here? I don't know. Um, 
Well, maybe hug him? Is that too soon? No, it's not. That will go. That will be fine, I think. No, he didn't like that. Okay, uh, well... Uh, is this is this a rom romantic action to admire someone? I'm not sure. Better not do that. Because Lester is right over there. Uh, and I just want to be friends with him. Well, let's talk to him and see. And then entertain him. Then maybe she will be friends with him. Brittany has fallen asleep. Did she have cake at all? I think I think you should have cake, Brittany. <laughs> it's very important. What was I doing? Right, I was going to put this boy in everyday clothing so that I can see. But I think his favorite color is turquoise, so that I can know what toy box to buy him. That <laughs> that's what I'm doing. All right, let's have this one because I I'm fairly sure it's the right one let's let's put it there that looks good how was the birthday party oh boring <laughs> brother grew up talked to some boys a random wolf came in it did it came in. oh my goodness it did <laughs> oh my goodness what is it doing it's sniffing Seth all right okay does she know Seth I think she should say hello to him Talk to Seth too. Ah, uh, the wolf gate got out again. Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah it came in. The, the party is not boring. It's a good time. It says so right here. <laughs> uh, no upper lip found. No. Yeah. Well, no, he doesn't have that. You know, is someone ringing the doorbell? Oh, now he's coming here to complain. Is this a neighbor? Where would he live? I don't know. Maybe it's the roommate of someone. We can't say hello to him. It's too crowded out here. <laughs> That's not possible. Yeah, he can't complain. It's full of walls. Oh, there's so much noise. I'm just talking, you know. Well, don't call the police, please. Well, it's appar apparently it's impossible to put him in the everyday clothes, but he wants to get an A plus report card. So if he had, and he wants to get a puppy. Well, I can't fit any more. Well, technically it could eat from here and sleep there, but then we need a dog bone and I don't know where to put it. So there will be no dog. <laughs> we might do another cat if some, someone wants a cat. Oh, and he wants to get Bruno into private school. Yeah, we could try that. Invite headmaster. He won't come until much later. Oh, Brittany is uh, having a pillow fight with Ginger. There's no no bad drama here. Everyone is just happy. Oh, and you should say hi to William. Uh, talk to William because you're like sort of the same age. Uh, yes, we want to invite the headmaster. Thank you so much for the follow. Ja Juan Cool 234. <laughs> cool? Well, thank you for the follow. I hope you enjoyed here. There, you can have. Oh, he. He wants to make a best friend. I'm not logging the A plus uh, report card in because I feel like every child gets that when they grow up into a child. And I feel like we, um, if we lock that in, everyone gets an A, a plus and it's uh, no challenge. <laughs> 
Receive friendly hug. Well, that would be nice. Why aren't you friends yet? Make a joke with him. If you can tear yourself from Lester for a little bit. I think this is a good party. Lots of things going on, everyone having a nice time, no one is fighting. It's all nice. Now it comes to complain again. Well, we're almost done with the party. <laughs> Don't come and complain. It's it's fine. Gonna break it up soon. Is she still not friends with with him? That's very weird. Well, I think this is your bed. Oh my go goodness, how late it is. Everyone will have to go to bed now. At least the children. What are you grown-ups doing? He still wants the uh, cleaning skill point. So I guess try and do that and then you can also clean up. And Brittany, she just wants children and more she wants to get another kitten. I'm not sure that's a good idea. But we could. We have room for another kitten. Why did? Why is it she's so obsessed with kittens? <laughs> she already has one. You know. Are you taking our kitten? He's going home. He's holding our kitten. Let it go. Hey, don't steal the kitten! What are you doing? Cornelius, get your own! <laughs> He's taking our kitten! Oh dear, i save that somewhere else. I don't know. What are you doing? Is he actually going to leave with it? He left with the kitten. Oh, it got respawned somewhere? There it is. Okay. Kittens, potato chips, no one can just have just one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that is true. Well, I guess she can she can she can get another kitten. Call service and then also bang on the wall. Hey, shut up. We're trying to have a party in here. <laughs> well, party is over but you know they were having they were being noisy like five minutes ago and now she's like shut up uh pet adoption service get a kitten and we have four to choose from there's not any more kittens yes i feel like if we get this one then we can tell them apart and I'm gonna see um, there's a Miss Intelli clause. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Oh, we can't fit the name. Oh, Oreo. But she's orange. Um Well, there's so many names to choose from here. I can't choose. Uh, maybe Mini. That's a good name, right? <laughs> there. Do you want to adopt Mini? Yes. I do. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, and then she should... I think she should go to bed. It's, it's very late. And auto lights too. <laughs> That's good. There. Well, if you want a cleaning.
skill point and you just, you just clean everything up after the party, you know? Mini is here. Oh, he got his uh, cleaning skill point. Now he wants to reach cleaning level 5. Okay, well... Is Brittany greeting the new kitten? Yes, she is. Well, we have to carry them in. Hello. Aww. If I if I tell her to go here, will she carry the kitten inside too? Uh, I think so. Hope so. Yeah, we need to get them inside. Can you like stop holding that? There you go, and then go pick this one up too. Pick up, because we need to have them inside. Wait, I need to. I need to inspect this kitten. They're so cute! Oh my goodness! Have you seen anything this cute, like, at any point in your life? Ah! Oh dear. <laughs> I'm saving all the pictures in the wrong spot again, but it's I'm going to move them. There and go inside. First try. But then actually go use this filthy toilet and go to sleep because it's very late. Now, Gavin, you don't need cleaning skill point. You want charisma and body. Well, maybe he can stop that. I think he was tired, right? Yeah, so. Oh, bang on wall because apparently Dustin is doing something in here. I don't know. Uh, he is living alone with the roommate now because uh, I don't remember who Meadow fought with, but it was someone, and she got sent to prison. So there, that's what she is. <laughs> There, we have successfully completed a day in the life of the this uh, Nusum family here. So, according to the spreadsheet... Um, I'm just thinking like we could we could play them for another day because I don't think they're gonna adopt another one because there there's no room so we could just continue uh, playing them for one more day and then we will um, we will be done with autumn for, for this family so we'll just keep going with these uh, Britain's bank deposit account has gained an interest of 100 simoleons. That's very nice. And he thinks she's gonna get a baby bump now. I was wondering about that. Or? No, she's getting up because Dustin is being noisy again. Shut up, Dustin. What are you doing? We're going to go and yell at him. Complain about noise. Because, like, this is... Okay, well, he stopped. <laughs> Next time, I'm gonna go and complain about noise to him because he should learn to shut up. Uh, but you could. Well, is it too early to serve breakfast? No, it's not. Make omelets for breakfast. She still hasn't gotten her baby bump. When when was it that they tried for baby? I think it was fairly early in the morning. Oh, he went back to bed. 
Oh, you're way over there because you don't have a trash can. Well, it's it's quite close. We don't need to buy one yet. <laughs> we will have a school bus soon. So Amy, you'll have to wake up. Maybe we should put a uh, an alarm clock over there. That would be nice. I like alarm clocks. No, wait, maybe maybe I put one of these dressers too, because then we can have more options for dressing up. And I want an alarm clock. Just because we can put an alarm clock, I think we should. And we could set it for school. So it will wake the children up in the morning. It's gonna be nice. Oh, she didn't like the alarm clock. <laughs> well, that's too bad. Maybe you can... Well, it's time for breakfast. Now, don't don't serve breakfast to the entire neighborhood. I, I don't think that's good. Little Bruna wants to jump rope and get good grades. Get a best friend. Hmm. Who could be his best friend? Maybe he would be good friends with Juliet Newburb. That would be cool. They're like cousins, I think. See, that's uh, Ginger's daughter, so they're cousins. The school bus is here, but the children hasn't eaten yet. <laughs> they have a little bit more time to eat. We can get them to be more full. Well, maybe Bruno don't have to eat. I don't think he was that hungry. Go to school, Bruno. What about Amy? Oh, she's a bit more hungry. She's gonna keep eating for a little while. But you can't miss school because <laughs> you'll get taken away. <laughs> we can't have that. If she gets taken away af after school, uh, because of her grades, then I'm gonna cheat her back because I don't think that should count. Because, like, uh, Britain and Gavin has done nothing wrong. Like, just because she has an F. But I'm hoping that will sort itself out. But I'm not sure it will. But she went to school in good mood. I found the mod for the error getting off the bus without parents. It's from a 2012 thread on Mod The Sims. Um, I'm not sure you're gonna be allowed to put the. Is it from is it from this uh, mod creator, or is it like? Hmm. Maybe you can like send me a, a private message with a with a link if you're not allowed in the. In the chat, I'm I'm not sure. <laughs> Links are allowed in the chat. Oh look, it was allowed. Thank you. Fantastic. Um, is it um, down here? Ooh, getparents.rar. Tunis official once made a mod to fix that issue, and it's hosted nowhere. Uh, but here it is. And now I downloaded it. Fantastic. I'll put it in later. But it's not an issue in this family, so it's not it's not urgent right now. But thank you so much because it was really bugging me whenever it happened. Sometimes I want foster children, you know. And that's Yeah. So you eat that and then put Leftovers away. Gavin, you're hungry and it's morning, so 
grab a plate and eat with your wife. It's nice for change to have like a, just a family where no one is cheating <laughs> and bad things happen. Oh no, maybe now I jinxed it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, I hope it's gonna be fine. And then you can clean this and fill bowl. Brittany, get your baby bump. I want to see your baby bump. <laughs> Well, she's done eating, but she's very tired. She has no desire to get any job. She's like a stay-at-home mom, and it seems to be working well. Yeah, I think I think according to my calculations uh, over here, they should be fine. Uh, with that. Unless I missed something. I'll, I'll look uh, more closely later. Uh, if she gets a baby bump, I think she would stop doing that. <laughs> Go sleep. You're very tired. And he still wants that cleaning skill point, so I'm gonna use that as an excuse to clean. <laughs> Because it's really needed. Who's this? Oh, Gina is here. Hello, Gina. She is back to being just a townie after having... Um, well, she's not having had an easy easy life so far. Let's just say that. Uh, she, she lost... <sighs> Well, she lost her boyfriend and her baby, sort of. <laughs> you know, it's alive, but it's uh, it's complicated. I can't get into it right now. And she's walking away. Stop! If you just wait until I finish the toilet, then I can talk to you. Who's this Lily do? I don't know who she is. I'm not gonna talk to her. Do you want it? Hello. There we go. Baby bump. So it's 11 on Friday. So we are expecting a baby. Can remove this. Pregnant. Do. So when? Uh, Saturday, Sunday. At. 1300 hours. I think that's right. There you go. She's gonna have a little winter baby. Take picture. We need picture of this. <laughs> oh my god. She has matched her pajamas with, with the decor. <laughs> well, I think she likes purple. It seems like. And we can change into maternity. But she's still tired. Oh, well. Change back, I guess. <laughs> hey, where the where did the purple pajamas go? Hmm. Oh well. Well, he wants to go to the Far East on vacation. I'm not gonna do that. He still wants the stereo. He wants the private school. I'm gonna lock that in. Get the kids into private school. Wait, Amy is his daughter too, right? Yes. So we'll have at five o'clock, we're gonna have the headmaster over. Wait, is he going to to work today? 2 p.m. to 8 p.m. Oh, so he's not, he's not going to be here when the headmaster comes. Hey, Gavin, is Bruno available to talk? 
No, and neither are you. <laughs> well, I'm gonna say yes to know what else would call, and we can focus on cleaning up in here. Because he wants the, to be clean when the headmaster comes. What, what can't you get to? Oh, he doesn't want to clean. <laughs> oh no, he doesn't want that. Because he's so sloppy. Oh dear. Well, you're gonna have to make a... Uh, an effort now that you want if you want your child to get into private school then that's what it's gonna have to happen parsley what is parsley doing here all the time hello um he seems to have, be having troubles <laughs> clean that up should i buy a stereo where should we put a stereo in here? I don't know if we can fit one. Well, if I if I move this cat, um, maybe I just buy that. What if I need it, and then we can have a stereo instead. Should I have this expensive one? I like this one. This is so nostalgic look at this it's like one of those things that i used to have with the cds underneath it so nice parsley is there to spice up your life <laughs> oh <laughs> well that makes sense <laughs> all right he's making food apparently Amy is doing better at school. Oh my goodness, I, I'm, I'm glad because... Wait, that's not Amy. This is Amy. She now has a D. That is awesome. She won't get taken away. <laughs> that would be kind of awful. Mm. She was not uh, happy with that report card. And she has... She wants to buy a to toy dog pen. We can't fit that in here. She wants to be friends with Seth too. Well, let's have her call one of these boys then. But she has no desire to, to do her homework. So, you know, she might get taken away at some point. <laughs> because she has quite a long time to go. Wait, wait, did he just miss? No, he, he went to job to his job. That's good. Okay, uh, well, she, what I was saying is she has quite a long time until she goes to college or like grows up, so she might um, meet with the social worker if she keeps doing like this, not doing her homework. <laughs> Can you like be my friend, please? Doesn't seem to go too well, does it? She likes Cornelius, but he he doesn't like her back. Let's try with Seth instead then. <laughs> mm, where is he? There he is. Call Seth Newverb. Let's talk. There. Adoptive cousins. <laughs> she also wants. To, oh, here's Shelby, looking in on her. I guess she wants to talk about hobby. Maybe it's easier to fulfill that want. Let Let's just go here. Talk to Shelby. Hello. How are you doing over here? Oh, I got bad grades. Well, you gotta work on that, you know. Talk about hobby science. Um, 
Gina is here again. We can talk to her too. And now she wants to be friends with Bruno. Well, that that might be easy. I hope. So I'm gonna lock that in. Here's Dustin. <laughs> Hello, Dustin. What are you doing? Oh, uh, he's going back in. What? What are you doing? Oh well. Bruno bought a friend home from school today. Is that uh, Diana Goth? I think he brought home Diana Goth. But he still wants to to no. He doesn't still want that. Now she <laughs> he want, he just want to be with Diana. All right. Okay. So let's talk to her then. Diana. Talk. He wants to chat with her and play with her. Little Diana is the child of Lucy, formerly known as Burb, and Alexander Goth that tragically got also got scared to death by ghosts. That seems to happen a lot in my game. <laughs> So, you know, um, see if she wants to play cops and robbers. <gasps> he wants to ask for homework help. That's good. Oh, what, what are you doing, Amy? Are you like jump bugging around all, all over the place? Oh, she's in desperate need of fun. Oh, so many tragic backstories. Yeah, when I play, I'm not the best Sims 2 player. So, you know, um, stuff happens. <laughs> but yeah, um, my Sims do not have easy lives. Uh, it, stuff happens all the time. Uh, maybe I... Wait, wait. So her hobby is science. So maybe she wants to go out, I think. No, that's nature to look for bugs. Um, is there something we could do that would be... I don't think so. She could do with a telescope, but I can't fit one of those in here. Hmm. Read science section. She could do that. Uh, read section. Science. Maybe that would be fun. They usually gain more fun if you chose the right activity for them. The end thing is science. Mm? You might be right. I don't even know where to put that. Because I put this little thing here. We could do... If I... Well, it could fit here. And then... We can have a little table over here. And then we can put the alarm clock there. And what category is that then? Here. There. She can have some ants. There! Mm. Well, the science section is quite fun. Well, that's good. Oh, we, Britain is pregnant, so we in, we need to make sure that we <laughs> that we check on her from time to time, so that, that she doesn't starve to death. She can resume that cooking, so that the food doesn't go to waste. Oh, Gavin is jamming to some music at work when a co-worker approaches him and asks what he is listening to. Gavin is a bit embarrassed by his new. Way, new wave indie jam pop collection and isn't sure if she 
should let his co-worker listen to it? Should he hand over the headphones or lie about his music? Well, I think he he should just give the headphones. It only takes a few seconds of listening to Sobop number four minor what before his co-worker hands the headphones back to Gavin and excuses himself. Clearly put off by Gavin's musical choice. He never out again asks Gavin about his music. Gavin loses some music and dance enthusiasm. Well, that was apparently wrong. <laughs> hey, I bought ants for you. Go, go look at them. <laughs> and he wants to do his homework. So... Brittany could help Bruno with homework now. I think you played enough. Well, actually, she's eating. So keep keep playing. I don't know. Oh, well, that's a nice clipping there. <laughs> I should really like to have an ant thing like that, but I'm too worried about the ants escaping and uh, then we would have ants everywhere. We don't want that. <laughs> she does want to be friends with Bruno, so maybe Amy should help him with his homework. Well. Well, he's gonna ask his mother. Because she, she's right there and she's not bored like Amy is. <laughs> Got to think about these things. Maybe do something fun. There you go. This is going well. Wait, wait, weren't the headmaster coming? Doesn't he usually turn up at five? That's weird. Did he go again? I don't know. Well... We have the option to invite headmaster again. I'm gonna try in case he comes at six, but I think he comes at five. But we did invite him. That was weird. Maybe you need to do it, like, closer to the time. Yes. I'll be over for dinner at 5 p.m. So we missed Friday. Why, why didn't he come? He should be here. Oh, <laughs> he's, he is here. He is coming. But he... Okay. Well, I don't know. Everybody aged up, though. So why did he come now? That doesn't make any sense. So, now, Gavin is 38, Brittany is 31, Amy is now 11, and Bruno is 6. And I haven't noted Amy's sign in my spreadsheet, so we need to fix that. Mm. And she is a Leo. All right. Yeah, that was strange. I, I don't really understand. Uh, we do not have food to serve. So we'll have to work on serving dinner. What should we do? Hamburgers, maybe? And Amy, you can like greet the headmaster and give him a tour and stuff. Greet. We'll have to continue the homework later, apparently. Hello! So let's give him a tour, give tour. Amy is stinky, but we can't help that right now. Okay. Can we show this room? Is this a good room to show? I don't know. Uh, 
Let, let's go inside. Oh, he did like the outside. <laughs> okay. That's good. Come here. And show this room. We don't have many rooms to show. I, I guess we'll go in here. But I think we'll get pretty good room to tours. Lush room. And then we can like go in here too. That was a, an okay room. Show this room too. Does he need to show to look at more rooms? Because then I need to. Uh, no, it was just the bathrooms left. So. <laughs> All right. So now, if Brittany puts that plate down, she can call him to dinner. But she apparently like Brittany needs to serve everyone food. Will there be food for the headmaster, even? Uh, let, let's just stop serving while, while there is still food. There, and entertain, call for dinner. I don't know. <laughs> well, he's, he seems to be going out there to eat, I think. Well... Angela is taking that hamburger. Okay, well, I guess I will have Amy can eat. I don't know. Brickner is not, is not that hungry right now. <laughs> All right, so the headmaster is just out here uh, eating by himself, but hopefully he likes the food. Um, then we just need to get some smooch, smooch, smooch smooth points in. Well, Brittany, maybe you can at least sit here. Uh, she's walking around in her uh, pyjamas. Well, that's just how it is. Gavin has returned from work and he earned 820 today. So that's fantastic. I think I might have to update his salary. 820. Well, he he's, he's raking in some money. So they should be able to afford a house soon-ish. Maybe next season that's how they start the season. <laughs> they just got this apartment ready. Well, I think they they want. Uh, oh, she's a family sim. That's why. All right. So now we just need to uh, well talk to him first. Sometimes you get smooch points just by talking to the headmaster. But then we can smooch about school. Maybe, maybe Gavin, oh well, he's very tired, isn't he? All right, he wants to go on a date. I'm gonna lock that in. I assume he wants to go on a date with Brittany. Wait, does people have extra fees? Amy does. Oh my goodness, she doesn't have any... Um, I'm gonna give her this tree because she's a popularity sim and then I'm gonna see what she all right so she would like these but she won't get any benefit from having this now so I'm just gonna yeah no so I'm gonna give her slower knee decay instead What is she doing? She's cleaning up. Oh, you're, you're so good, Amy. Well, oh my goodness, she's so neat. <laughs> the 
he basically adopted a, a a nanny here because she takes care of her little brother and she cleans up so that's nice this family needs it they're quite sloppy except for bruno because like how did this happen his parents are sloppy but he is very neat for some reason who knows I don't understand it, but that uh, that is what happened. Wait, what is going on? All right, so we are smooth. Oh, we already succeeded. <laughs> I think you could stop to talk to him now. Stop talking. He he will accept the children into private school, and then you can go have a bath. See, he is letting them in to private school. It's very dark out here. The headmaster is impressed with your family. Uh, Bruno just got into private school, but why didn't Amy get in? Was she already? No. Why didn't Amy get in? That's weird. Well, oh, maybe maybe it's because of her grades. He, she was, wasn't let in, but Bruno got in. All right, well, that's too bad, Amy. All right, she was all stinky pants. Go have it. Oh, that's busy. Who's in here? Oh, Bruno is in there. Hooray! Yes. Oh, now he's too tired to do the homework. Well, we'll have to try and do that in the morning then. Mm, why is Diana still here? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I think you need to be at least a C student to get in. Yeah, it makes sense. They wouldn't let her in when she has a D in school. But we are going to play until morning, and then I have to go and get breakfast. It's just the way it is. What are you doing now? Well, wash your hands until Diana decides to go away. M maybe we should, like, say goodbye to everyone. It's late. But Amy doesn't want to do that. Maybe Brittany does. What? <laughs> she took the shower! Oh no. Oh well. Maybe she asks everyone to leave because she thinks it's too late. Well, that that looks nice, Brittany. <laughs> oh, right. We need to check for names because Gavin he doesn't have any ancestors so, so he doesn't have any name suggestions so we'll just use Brittany and she could go with Myron we already have did I name a kid Mamie I don't think I did we have a little uh, girl named Coral in the game. It's Angela's daughter. Mm. We already used Bruno, so we could go with Myron. I don't think we have Myron. Um, let's see. Names. Myron or... Is there a Mime? Maybe? I don't know. 
Maybe. Uh, yes, we have a little Mamie Broke. Uh, Bo Broke uh, named her his daughter Mamie. Oh, and also, like, they got twins, and uh, he named uh, the boy, he named him Flat. <laughs> so he's flat broke. <laughs> That's quite fun. But so we can't use Mamie. We could use Irma. Is there an or Irma already? Irma? No. We have no Irma in the game. So I'm going to add that as a name suggestion. So she has one for, but I usually like to have one for a boy and a girl. But she don't have more suggestions, I think. Wait, we could go further back maybe. No, we can't. That's as far as it goes. Yeah. Okay, so then if, uh, if, if she would get twins, of the same gender, we would have to find a, uh, a random name. She wants to be friends with Amy. Yeah, that, that's a good idea. <laughs> and Amy wants to have fun. And Bruno wants to sleep. And we need to feed the cats. Now that the family is growing, the bathroom seems too small. <laughs> oh well. Serve ants. Stop being bored. Bored. Well, that was apparently too boring for her. So, read the science section. And also, what's wrong with this cat? Is it hungry? We can actually check. Oh my goodness, it's hungry. Well, maybe Minnie will stop eating soon. There you go. Well, at least she's getting her fun up and then she can go to sleep. Amy has gained enthusiasm in science. She can now share tips about this hobby with other sims. Well, that's good. Now go sleep. Well, actually, take a shower. Gavin is going to get up super early and take a shower. And then he's going to uh, help Bruno with his homework. Ask Gavin for homework help. I hope I time them together well so that he will get good grades. You want to do a good impression in his new school that he's going to today. No, it's not going at all. It's Saturday. That's good. Stop with the cat. Help Bruno with homework. Well, it, it was unnecessary that they got up this early, but now they did. What, what is happening? Why aren't they doing the homework? Ask Gavin with homework. You stop that. 
Can you do it? Yeah, of course. I'll help you. There you go. That's what little Bruno wants to do. And I should stop playing, but I want to see that he does his homework first. Amy can sleep in. And so can Brittany, if she wants to. There you go. You learn homework. And now he also wants to do the homework. There you go. Fantastic. If he were like closer here, I could lock this in, but now I'm not gonna do it. He wants to see snow because now it is actually officially winter season. And I'm gonna end the stream because that's the end of the season for this family. And if you're watching this on YouTube, have a super duper time until next time and stay safe and take care. And if you're on Twitch, stay tuned for a raid. So to the YouTube people, goodbye. <laughs>